Alright everybody, it's Austin here from Dream and Rotary. What I'm going to go over today is a low oil pressure problem when the oil is hot in this Renesis rotary motor in my RX-8 here. I just did the rebuild in it um, 250 miles ago. I had it on for about 50 miles. I ran it um, with my wife. We went out for Valentine's Day. It was the first time I drove an RX-8 and the first time I drove this rebuilt motor. Um, I had noticed that when I was cranking it, the oil pressure upon right after rebuild was low. It wasn't dangerous low, but it was low enough to cause concern. It was only getting about the single digits when I was cranking it. I had the plugs in and I had the fuel pump out so it wouldn't flood. So I cranked it a couple times to build oil pressure. When I started it, the oil pressure was good. It was about 50 PSI or so at um, about 2000 RPMs. <laughs> Crack open the door. And then it slowly dropped as the car got warmer. Uh, I started to notice once it got to about 150, 160 degree oil temp, the pressure dropped dangerously low at idle towards the single digits and it would read zero at idle when the oil temp was above 150. So the idle's down, I've got zero PSI at idle according to this gauge. Oil pressure gauge of course doesn't really mean anything. It's warmed up completely, you can see there oil temp is at 215, that one works fine. But if you add just up to about 1500, right about there, about 1700, about 8-9 PSI. About 2,500, I got 21 PSI, 22. About 3,000, I got 23. About 3,500, I got 24, 25. Back down to idle, right back to zero. So maybe I'm freaking out about nothing, but maybe there is actually a problem. So we're going to go through, check all the stuff out, and uh, hopefully I don't have to tear the front cover off because that will put me down another week um, of driving this thing. And I really do want to start getting it out as long as the weather holds up here in Minnesota.